February 27th. Yes. So it's the day after the sale. We're at home. It's a bit of like, I've been up since, the house is a little bit of a mess, but I've been up since like 4.30, just like working on, working on the Girl Power University. And it feels like we've had like a long night. Yesterday was so long. We ended up at about 8,000, I think. So that's good. We surpassed our goal. That's always awesome. And um, that shopping cart has literally been in here all week. <laughs> There's a shopping cart at our apartment. They let you like have shopping carts if you wanna go around and shop. And sometimes we're, we have a lot of stuff to carry so we bring them upstairs. But um, I'll probably bring it down when I take out the trash or whatever. But yeah, it's the next day. Feeling so much better now that that's behind us. The next task is uploading like vlogs and getting all of this started and then of course going to work the last few days of work two more days of work and we have a lot of new stuff in the works so we're excited but I got the sink running and I have to get all of our meals ready for the day because we have a lot of things to eat and we want to stay on with that but outside of that I look kind of crazy outside of that my arms weak outside of that no gym today but there will be gym tomorrow and i still don't know where i look I'm supposed to look here or there we'll figure it out but anyway so we're getting ready to go to work i'm gonna cook everything and we'll probably see you at work it'll be a quick a quick vlog today <sighs> she'll probably just come and tell you everything that we're doing but that's it good morning Okay, so yesterday was super draining. Mentally draining? Yeah, it was like a uh, okay physical day. You know, the same amount of like standing that we would normally do if the store was open or if we had clients, but probably emotionally draining. So like at 6.30, I went to bed. I was tired. And then I stayed in, in bed. Yeah, because we're gonna be leave, leave, leaving our business. We're yeah. shutting that down. That's the reality of like, yeah, not so. having those interactions. Yeah, so um, definitely a lot of the ladies that came in yesterday were ladies that, I think maybe I mentioned it, ladies that we've known for years. And I talked about it before, um, being in a new space and not knowing anybody um, and people not knowing us. So maybe like that, that part is probably like the ego part of me. Like, oh my God, I'm going to go somewhere and be a nobody. You know, when technically here we are, you know, small town people. So that's different, but yesterday was more the realization that dang these people that i've known for so long that i've seen have kids graduate anything you could go get married get divorced anything that you could see somebody do we've seen them do in our time as like hairstylists here and that'll be crazy now i see melissa or candace or morgan and you know it's so many names that we've seen so much agree and her two boys who come to us all the time and we're always so you know hugging and getting to know them and watch them grow so that's gonna be different maybe difficult probably initially like oh dang i'm not gonna see so and so i'm not gonna know how she's doing the shunda you're gonna be on the other side of the world to where you're not in the same time zone yeah, can't, can't be in the same time zone to connect. So that's a little bit like, and I'm an emotional person. So I was a little sad. I was a little sad when I picked up the camera yesterday. I had to put the camera down. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, wow. Anywho, so it was like emotionally draining. I got look, baby oil on my face again. But it was emotionally draining day. However, it's really good because we get to do something new. I've never done anything new. New? Not like, no, not like this. Or anything close to this. Not anything new. So that is... Usually you go off to college. That's your plan. Yeah, and I didn't. I went to technical school. So I didn't go off to college. You with your man. Yeah, I never moved anywhere. I live in the same 10 mile radius. Everything we do is right here. Our gym is four minutes away. The shop is four minutes away. My parents' house is 10 minutes away. So everything is in this circle. So um, the reality that we're gonna be very much out of this circle and in the world is like, it's coming, it's coming. 
but we're in the last few days of the salon floor being open we have a pretty full schedule today so we'll see the ladies we don't talk about the move with the ladies or anything like that we don't want to um scare them because <laughs> when you talk about oh if we're moving they get really they get sad um because their hairstylists are, are leaving and it's really hard I guess to find people who do what we do in the time frame that we do it because we do it fast and the price we're pretty inexpensive so we haven't scared our clients yet we're just slowly fast, moving 45 minutes and it's yeah fast. 45 minutes sewing that's that's short so it's called um take like three four hours inexpensive it costs 85 dollars for a partial partials for are full. usually it's usually for a full 65 for a partial partials are usually 150 full 200 so we're real cheap real fast real reliable because we work every single day so we're leaving that structure and our retail store to go make everything else happen for our business so today's a good day it's gonna be fun. Yesterday was a great day, sales-wise. So I'm looking forward to it. Not gonna get too sad thinking about it. Just gonna let everything happen so we can move forward to bigger and better. Oh yeah, okay, so in addition to being all sad about um, uh, like not seeing the ladies again, the other thing I was feeling like was, where was all of this energy before? You know, we would have open store hours and we would see like five people in a day. Yesterday, we say we moving, and everybody and their mama show up, which is nice, but it makes me think if if we would have had that kind of support um, before, would we even be um, shutting down our retail store? But I think this is a much better opportunity for us. We definitely this is something that needed to happen for our business. And however, I was a little salty. I was like, girl, I ain't seen you in a minute in here. Where you been? coming in here with somebody else bundles in you know we sell bundles but that is the nature of it whenever you have that super dirt cheap pricing whenever you have that moving sale you're definitely gonna see people you haven't seen before and they gonna rack up because that's what the ladies were doing anywho see you guys later we gonna be late and I'm never late Yeah, it's colder than what I thought it was gonna be today. See ya. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, See ya. Thank you. Three. Bye bye. Yes. Um, I think this is remember to do. See ya. Bye -bye. Yes. You're welcome. See ya. I'm getting ready to keep eating i've been drinking a lot of water just trying to stay on my diet some days are harder than others and when we get home what do we have to do we have to do a little computer work get out of here at four o'clock that's a good day and it's a two more days until we're closed closed you see how empty it is behind me it's so empty it used to have like a 16 foot table in there it's gone so that's pretty cool but anywho, the day is going well. Diet is being kept. My fave shirts, I have like four of these shirts. I had to make a pit stop to our parents' house because they took the shop key, can't lock it up. And now it's time to see the dog. Yay. 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 I, it's my dog, but she lives with my parents. It's not your dog. It's my dog. It's really I'm a bad mom. I'm kind of a bad mom. Daddy. Hello, daddy. Hello. Oh, how was your day at work? Day. You saw what I did. You saw what, what I did. What you did? I had to get out there and work. Give me, give me a little bite. Give me a little bite. That looks good. That's a little bite. Mm -hmm. I got a whole one for you if you want it. Mm -mm, mm -mm. You know my calories. Oh, mm, daddy, daddy. Oh, crazy. Get the dog out. Mmm. That's good. No, just a little bite, daddy. Just a little bite. Just a little bite. That's it. Hey, mom. You want some too? <laughs> you want some too? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm Marlo. Y'all. Mm -mm. I'm not Marlo. Here. I don't no. want none. Uh -uh, I don't want 
So that's the end of the vlog. We're finally home yeah. and today was a full day. Yeah, time to go to sleep. <laughs> I look crazy. Time to go to sleep. Every time you look crazy on camera, you don't be wanting to be on camera. You gotta embrace it like me. Bye. Mm -hmm.